are trying to do with the CHIPS Act is to make sure that we make basically Europe appealing for businesses. And tonight's event is a demonstration of such cooperation where business is excited to invest in Europe. Especially if you look to Sachsen-Anhalt, where Intel is invested in now in Magdeburg, we have actors from the region. We have, for example, SMEs who work there uh, and who are really interested to work together with the big company Intel. And we have to find a solution. And in the end, I think it's a benefit for all. The biggest problem at the moment is shortage of shortage of semiconductors. At the same time, while demand is rising in the auto world faster than it is on the market as a whole. We will also benefit from having shorter supply chains, better predictability, that's better for manufacturing overall. And I hope we can also have products, semiconductors, that are better suited to the auto industry's needs, the kind of larger scale nodes that we have, and to have this kind of closer cooperation with semiconductor manufacturers that will allow us to develop new technology. I think that regions and cities in Europe play a very important role in the resilience of Europe. The way to stay ahead is to innovate. And to innovate, you need uh, really skilled R&D people, but also practical uh, engineered people. Regions really know to bring uh, together the big companies, the startups, the SMEs, the researchers and the employees. What's important for Europe's industrial policy is to make sure um, that it reinforces our innovation potential. And by doing so, I believe it would contribute to economic growth, to more jobs, and to making sure we truly invest in these cutting-edge technologies. It's a benefit for all the big company Intel, it's a benefit for all the SMEs, and in the end, we, have, uh, we, we are stronger together, and this is what is important. And we are looking to the future, we are really happy with this investment now. The takeaways from the uh, event this evening is the need for a developing ecosystem to foster investments in the semiconductor industry, the uh, critical importance of collaboration uh, amongst industry stakeholders uh, and also with the public sector, and last but not least, uh, it's very important I think for Europe to find uh, ways to attract right talent uh, which is necessary and critical to develop uh, a robust uh, semiconductor industry in Europe. Uh, Europe needs to massively invest in semiconductor manufacturing. Uh, today it has a small market share in global manufacturing. It needs to increase its market share. And in order to achieve that, it only has one option, which is to invest in manufacturing. And it will uh, have to uh, help private sector investors to make those investments. Uh, by uh, developing the right policy tools, and those include uh, subsidies and state aid.